hello again YouTube this is Mr. Beam with another video in today's video I'm going to show you how to create a 2d digital item for structural bolts so this detail is familiar to do to you in my previous video I actually showed you how to create the world and you can find the link to it in this corner now typical column splice detail and the bolts so whenever we want to represent the the bolts the plan view of the bolts as a structure bolt we are sh going to show it as a, a black circle with a cross so specifically this detail um, has a, a radius which I prefer to show it as a diameter I'm not sure why it's set up with the radius but the thing is whenever I joined this company so it's already was there so um, let's create it um, but having the diameter parameter also we could have it in like a different types like a M20 M16 M12 which is diameter of the bolt in this case it's 4 m20 and its radius is 10 that means the diameter is 20 so how to create it so first we have to go to the file and going to the new and family let's go on the English inside the family templates and looking for metric detailed item and let's open it amazing so here I'm going to create that uh, field region circle which is black I'm going to on the um, detail clicking on the field region and we need to click on the edit type to change it to a black let's duplicate it and just call it black click on OK we are going to set uh, we are going to set the foreground field pattern as a solid fill and the color is black black which is that OK I'm going to click on OK um, the line around the subcategory of the detail items which is OK I'm going to click on the circle on the draw and I'm going to click here and just um, to left click here and that's it I'm going to click on the finish edit mode and we have our black circle I'm going to select it again and let's go to the edit boundary and let's type di for dimension we want diameter I'm going to click on diameter and clicking on the outer premier line of the the, the circle so it will um, create the diameter I'm going to click on this blue dot and I'll drag it here to just make it more clear and I'm clicking and I'm hitting on the escape button so by clicking on this dimension I can assign a cre I can assign or create a parameter well we don't have any pre-existing parameter so I cannot assign it so I have to create it um, let's click on this icon and I want it as an instance so we can change it very quickly and it wouldn't be um, a type parameter so let's call it DIA which means diameter and let's click on OK let's go to the properties family types and if I bring these family types let's have a default for 20 which is a representation of m20 bolts which 20 millimeter diameter and let's click on OK and let's click on finish edit mode so now let's add the the two lines uh, actually the four lines so I'm going to go to the create and line 
I'm going to create a line from the center to the right and I'm going to create another line from the center to the left and same thing to the up and to the down by typing di I'm going to click first on this line which is a reference plane and then picking um, the tip of this line which is there and I'm just going to drag it somewhere here so this dimension is too big I'm going to change the scale to something like a 1 to 5 to make it a little bit smaller and I'm clicking uh, hitting the escape so what we want we want to change to have this one double of the radius so I'm going to click on this and creating the parameter as let's say cross and I'm going to click on OK so how much the cross should be I'm going to click on the family types and if we change the cross to let's say 40 and click on apply it will change it like this so the diameter is 20 that means the radius is 10 so this should be 20 so technically that means this cross is equal to diameter so let's just make it like that on formula the cross is equal to dia and I'm clicking on the, the enter we can also lock it so nobody can change it so I'm going to click on apply so if I change the diameter to 12 so it will just automatically change its um, length so what we have to do we have to do the same cross parameter for the other three lines so I'm going to type di click in this line tip of this line somewhere here clicking this reference plane to tip of this line I will put it somewhere here clicking here and clicking under the reference plane and tip of this line and I'm going to click it somewhere here so I only have to select all these three dimensions by holding the control key so you can see the uh, the plus symbol will appear close to the cursor and I'm going to click on this one and click on this one then I can assign the label as a cross 12 perfect so let's test it again family types I'm going to change this one to 20 and I'm clicking on apply it will make this cross bigger let's click on OK and um, let's just make it a little bit more sophisticated I'm going to click on the lines all of them by holding the control key and there is a parameter on the graphics visible and there is a associate family parameter here I'm going to click on it and I'm going to create a new parameter which is its type is yes and no and I'm going to set it as instance I want just to have a, like a show cross symbol so plus symbol show it's not so it's show show cross and clicking on OK and clicking on OK so um, let's save this family as M X bolt I'm going to save it with one option for recovery and hit the save I'm going to load it to the project so we have a bolt here I can change its, its diameter whenever I'm clicking I can change its diameter to 12 it will change its diameter to 12 we can even measure it we can type di to measure which is 5 
5 plus 5 is 10. Well, the, okay, so the thing is, if I type un, and I, if I go to the length, so it's rounding to the nearest 5. Let's change this one to 0 decimals, and clicking on OK, clicking on OK, and now, if I type the I and check in this radius, the radius is 6, which means the diameter is 12, uh, which shows that it's M20. Sorry, it's 12, M12. So now we have this family, and we can just uh, replace these bolts with the, the family we just created. So I'm going to select and typing MX bolt and its diameter is 20 we can change it to diameter 10 we can change it to 16 to test we can change it to 20 again because this text says it's 4M20 which is these two oh okay so the thing is this one is 2M16 I my bad sorry I these two are different from the, the bolts we have here. So I'm going to delete this one and these two should be 16 for the diameter. Now this is the correct detail. This is the end of this video. Thank you so much for watching.